Hey guys, welcome back to more AFK Arena. In today's video, we have another code. This is like our fourth code in about five or six days, I think it is. But what this code does is show me that... Lilith are very much on the same page as me, as in they really don't care about Valentine's Day because this is a pretty, pretty average code. But hey, freebies are freebies, so we'll take it. Uh, it's the Valentine's Day one. It's love, L-O-V-E, 214. I'll leave it in the pinned comment description. Also, I'll leave a link to the website where you have to do it on global server. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll leave a video there that goes through it. But that is the code. That's what we get. Unfortunately, like I said, uh, let's face it, when Chinese New Year's going on, uh, these companies don't really care about Valentine's Day, but does anyone really, does anyone really care about it this time of, time of year? I mean, try, imagine, like, imagine buying flowers at those inflated prices. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I always tell the missus, I'll buy them for you another time of the year when they're not inflated. And then I always forget. Yes, I'm a piece of shit. Let's move on. Let's do let's do a bit of a push on this account. See if we can clear this chapter. Get ourselves some summons. We're going to pop this first temple that we've got sitting here first. And then we'll see how we go. Now, do I have... Oh, I got stargazers. And I got... Ooh, ooh, we got time gazers and stargazers. All right. Let's go this first. This first. We've been pretty lucky. 64 for the first one. Then in our next temple, we got one. Then we, in our next temple, we got one. And then we've had one temple without. Let's see if we can get the luck here on this one. Yellow. No, okay. Give me a faction card. Give me a faction card. Oh, well, good chunk of experience. Let's call it that. All right, all right, all right. Stargazing. I, yeah, I'm still going to get a Shakira copy. Ooh, we got a wilder card. Okay, okay, that'll do. Let's do a temple. Beep, beep, beep. Ooh. Okay, dude. Dude, I, I, I've actually been desperate for that Nara. She comes off the wish list now, but I I just wanted a copy of Nara. Literally, so I had something to do with like units that annoy the shit out of me. Now, who do I want to put? I kind of want to put... She's one unit I haven't really tested too much. Uh, or do I just go save with like the Grizzle or... I'm not doing Thorin. Thorin cheese is, is, is absolute ass. Yeah, let's just do that. Let's just do that. That'll do this. All right, so let's do that. Uh, bag, do I have any stones? I think I'm like 10 away. No, I'm like 13 away. Sorry, I was pretty close on that guess. But uh, we did get that. Wait, wait, we got that faction card. Wilders, come on. Give me, give me, give me a new dude druid. Uh, I mean, honestly, we do need food. The other thing we did just do on this account, uh, we got, uh, dude, I, Atheus, dude, I just keep calling him Druid. We got him to Mythic, and we also got uh, Bones to Mythic. So we're looking pretty good with Druid Bones here. Uh, I got to I gotta go through and do a few more of the Peaks of Time uh, to get some more dust, and then I'll be able to get uh, another one to 180. But if we go boom, 18, 19, 20. Okay, so we can go ahead and we can sweep them all now. I just need to sit down and do it. These last, like the last like five Peaks of Times always just drain my soul but let's jump in here let's see if we can cap this chapter off uh then uh, dude uh you know we'll, we'll pay the 300 gems to change faction for the sake of for the sake of the video for out of respect to you guys hanging around if we manage to get it done because sometimes this takes a little bit to get done dude yes rem oh what no no dude thane is thane the boss in this one is thane the boss if Thane's the boss, it becomes, yeah, it becomes really annoying. This is, this just becomes RNG fest. It's like, oh, uh, okay. Uh, dude, that Shamir died so quick. Uh, Rem, Rem, live. Oh, yeah, but so close. Rem was so close to that ultimate. So close. Okay, bones. Shamir getting clapped way too quick. Might have to adjust the formation there. Dude, dude, Thane. Thane just absolutely wreaking havoc. Uh, can Bone survive in a front row? Because that would then let Shamira live a little bit longer. I don't know if Bones does because he gets stunned. Yeah, see, the problem is... The, the problem there is that Bone's front row gets clapped by the stun of Hogan rolling into when uh, old mate drops and then he can take damage. So that's a little bit better. Okay, okay, Druid's staying alive. Can we get an alt rem, please? Yes. Bones, get back on her. Mm, dude. Dude. We're, we're in a bit, a little bit, of, we're not even a 4x deficit now. We, we got a big power increase for our team with those two extra mythics, but it doesn't really change too much at this stage. 
Y your power deficit always looks way better. Oh, come on. Come on, surely. 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 Yes, okay. Your power deficit always looks be way better when you're using all the strong units at Elite because then it drags your power down. You're like, hey, look at my deficit. Hey, I can't help it. I do it too. I do it too, okay? It's, it's big flex, all right? Uh, all right, this should be fine. This should be fine. We'll delay. Uh, I might have to delay um, the uh, Ira because Ira's pain is that, yeah, I, I got to put Rem in the middle because with the timing of Gavis coming down, Ira's freezing arrow always one taps something. Like it always hits as soon as he lands. Like if you look at the timing, boom, there it is. But uh, okay, Ivan did get to use his ult, which is good because he's in blue health, but it doesn't matter because his ult's there and he's going to die when he detaches, but it doesn't matter because he got the functionality that we needed out of it. So that's where I do like the Shamira with bones. Uh, okay, we can delay Tassi. We kind of got to delay Tassi, that's fine. I think this one may take a few little formation changes. I'm just not too sure. Okay. Uh, yeah, Rem's dead. All right. I feel it. maybe we leave the Tassie and see if we can avoid uh, getting getting banished. I don't know. Oh wait, no. I got to move Bones because Bones is getting stunned at the start. That's it. Oh, ooh, ooh, no. Okay. Okay. We no no because uh, uh, Rem did get banished twice now. That kind of sucks. Mm, okay. Okay. We got we got to figure this out. We got to figure this out, guys. Um, 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 what if we do this? Let's try this. It's a matter of like just finessing the rem and trying to get her not. So she's banished. She's back. She's dead. Okay. So maybe we, maybe we just have to do the, um, maybe we just have to do the tassie delay so that Bones can get his shield off fast enough. So Bones, we need you to shield ASAP. Did rem, okay. Rem got the shield, which is good, which means we didn't get CC'd. Then we go tap. Then we go tap again. Dude, nice. Nice. All right, next. Next, next, next. Uh, all right, what do we got here? What do we got here? I think we kind of do the Ira. I think we do it like this. I think this will be fine. Oh, wait, Gavis is... I mean, uh, Druid's going to go up, which means we're at the mercy here. On Yeah, okay, yeah. That, that, was, that, was, um, that, that was my bad. That was my bad. So if we do this, this should be better. This should be better. Because then we get the stuns on them. And that should buy Rem the time. Unfortunately, Bones is getting tapped in that front row. Uh, so we'll do that. See if this works. It's all those stuns that happen as Gavis lands that just cost us. So there we go. Bones used an ult, which is good. Now Rem's going to ult, which is good. Now Shamira's going to die, but that's fine. And we just need another Bones ult on Rem. Rem ult, and then GG's. Dude, this... This is no more... She did, did not want to go down. She did not want to go down. That's okay. We got it. We got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right. Ooh, the old Athalia. But that's okay because we can absorb that Athalia damage. The Belinda is going to be a pain though. The Belinda is going to be a pain. Uh, obviously, Thane's always a pain. <laughs> that rhymed. Nah. All right, let's do that. I might put Bones front row on the top because Bones should live that front row. Not too bad. Okay, we're still alive with Rem somehow, dude. Rem, Rem, Rem was trying super hard there. I kind of like the Rem getting hit by the Athalia. I think if we do this, maybe this speeds it up a little, but we do get the knockdown, which may cost us from the Lucius. No, we okay, we get the ult off early, so that's okay. Get, get a second ult off, okay. Rem, please ult. Dude, dude, that... That pressure from that Athalia. I, I just feel like it's a good positioning though for Rem. I just feel like it's a good positioning. But Rem's dead. Okay, right. We'll, we'll try this one more time. And then I might put Rem up the top and swap with Shamira. See how this goes. Yeah, all right. Let's, let's try that. Let's try that. I could even try Rem going in front of the Lucius to delay the Lucius, and then we can go ahead and attack the Rain. I mean, it could be a thing. Mm, there's a lot of pressure on this one. There's a lot of pressure. What if we do that? Does that do anything for us? Who does Rem attack? Okay, Rem goes in on the Belinda, which is bad because we can get the Belinda bomb here, but we almost tap that Belinda pretty quick. Dude, this one's tricky. This one's super tricky. Right, let's see this. I still feel like the Rem getting hit by the Athalia was probably the best chance that we've had. We're just getting 
tap two like but like athalia and thane is just a pain in the absolute ass let's try this randomly i don't think this has a chance but let's just try it randomly see how it goes rem do you get an ult no we're just getting tapped so hard we're gonna do that one more time then i'll be back i may not get this one we may have to mercenary this we may this may be the first stage we have to mercenary what are we we're only on wednesday though i don't want to use a mercenary this i always do this i'm like i don't want to use a mercenary this early in the week and then i don't use it and then i never use my mercenary i'm so bad at mercenary management it's not my specialty let's just put it that way come on rem uh back in a sec all right guys it took a lot of persistence effort blood sweat and tears but we got there dude that one was that one was pretty difficult and even this formation once i got a whiff of it on this formation it probably took me like 20 or 30 tries to get it but looks easy in hindsight but it was not easy in actuality. So what I ended up doing was I took Rem off of the um, the Zolrath collection and put her onto the Saurus collection. It just, because running to the back row was just getting her killed too much, but I still wanted her up the top. And so that sort of helped with that. And then it was just a matter of getting the timing and having Rem just not die to the Belinda bomb. And yeah, that was pretty much it. So got there, got some good RNG with both Thane and uh, and Thalia not killing us. So got to take the wins when you can get them. Happy days. Moving into chapter 24. Okay, now we get that, we get that, we get that. Wait, do we have enough for a normal temple as well? Oh, dude, it is so huge when you get to chapter 24 and you clear chapter 23 and you get yourself a copy of Olmus. It's like one of the biggest things in the game. Like if you haven't got there yet... I, I, don't, I don't even know what to tell you. Like you're just missing out. So you've really got to work hard to get to chapter 24 so you can get that. It's, it's just, dude, they've really got to update those prizes. Like, who's the next chapter? Who's the next chapter? A Warwick. You go, you get this far into the game and it gives you an almost than a Warwick. Yo, yo. Lilith, can, can we update that? That is so bad. That's so bad. What events have I not done? Oh, it's just all this bullshit. Oh, yeah, this is Starzone. I, I have not checked back in there since I got my um, got my mind, but uh, but we'll, we'll go back there later. It's not too bad. We're on an early game account here. All right, 24. Wait, wait, surely, surely, surely we've got enough to get 300 gems here. Actually, wait, wait. You know what I haven't popped? I probably haven't popped gems in my bag. Your diamond chests where are they or do i not have any maybe i did pop them i'm an idiot oh you're on yoink story good story bud great story great story champ okay we, there's one more in here somewhere there's one more in here somewhere yes the old floppy all right that's it that's it that's it all right 10 pull on this boom Uh, rip. Okay. 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 Now we're going to go Wilders over here. Switch to Wilders. Oh, no. Guys. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> no. You know what? Screw it. We're just going to leave it. We're going to leave it. I'll, I'll do those in the next one because I know I'm going to pay 300 to change now and then I'm just going to pay 300 to change in like an hour and a half when it resets and that's just going to kill me. We'll do it in the next video. Next video, we'll do the summons. We'll try and get a bunch more as well. Anyway, guys, Valentine's Day. Don't waste your money on overpriced flowers. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day and I look forward to seeing you the next one. Cheers.